Reed Arena in College Station, Texas, where the Missouri Tigers get their first SEC win of the season, taking sets two, three, and four consecutively. Back to wrap things up, Tyler Denning, Missy Whittemore. And you start with that first set. It was Hall and Hands and the Aggies that came out looking like they were going to avenge their opening loss in SEC play. You thought they would, but as the match went on, we saw some freshman moments, and I think for Texas A&M, it was a little bit of growing pains. While for Mizzou, I think what we saw today was growing a lot of gains here as some of their youngsters really grew up in front of our eyes. Well, and the big story for Texas A&M, it was the reliance on Hall and Hand. She had a phenomenal match with 20 kills, but 55 total attacks, not a lot of balance from the Aggies. For the second time in her career, putting up 20 kills, but certainly hauling a whole lot of the load with that bloated number of attempts. She hits just over 100. And for Missouri, it was all about balance. 10 block assists for Alyssa Munlin and 10 kills to go with that. She hits 333. Melanie Crow, 11 kills of her own, hits 222. But freshman Lech member Manet ties her with a team high 11 kills. And the good news is, member Manet, only three errors, hits a really nice 348 on this match. So I was going to say that was really the story that it was lack of balance on the AM side and then the balance for Missouri as they close out the second set strong and then they continued into the third and fourth to notch their first win in SEC play on the season. Up next for the Tigers, they will go at Auburn. For the Aggies, they will be at Georgia. Missouri now eight and seven on the season. Aggies fall to three and six. Tigers victorious here in College Station.